back to another estrogen release video i am asia and in today's video back by popular demand and when i say popular i mean two people requested this on instagram a skincare haul basically the skincare products that i use so i brought a bunch of products um products that basically i can live without products that i just wanted to restock on and products that i wanted to try I really just wanted to kind of, you know, treat myself. Definitely needed to get the things that, you know, a part of my normal routine, but I also wanted to try some more products as well. So yeah, I'm pretty excited to show you guys what I got. I'm a product, um, I'm a product girly. I love products. Ever since I was like a uh, preteen, like I was always excited about buying products. And it's funny, my sister actually taught me how to do skincare, you know, the basics. Cleanse, tone, and moisturize. And y'all, when I thought it was rocket science, like I was like, it's just too much for my brain. Like, I just felt like I couldn't like grasp what I need to do for my skin. I've come a long way. I've come a long way and I got ways to go because I just love everything about skincare. So like I said, I'm gonna break down the things I can't live without, the things that I restocked on, and the products that I'm excited to try. My mini mo. I've been using this company since 2018. And the reason why I use this company and I'm loyal to this company is because when I started using it, I actually start seeing results. There's been so many different companies. I've been through so many different lines and, and products, but until I started this company or started using these products, I just saw a change in my skin, which was very, very encouraging. So I absolutely have to have their turmeric facial scrub. If I don't have this, or if I'm not exfoliating at least two times a week, baby, who am I? Like, I'm telling you, my skin starts to freak out. I literally had like a little um, face explosion about, I want to say mid July. And so basically, whenever I break out, I think breakouts are inevitable. Unfortunately, you know, that's just, it comes along with skin. Um, but whenever I break out, I always make sure that I'm starting to use this because once the breakout clears up, baby those acne scars my face loves hyperpigmentation and if you are of a darker skin tone turmeric is your holy grail i'm not even trying to like exaggerate it has helped me out tremendously with brightening my skin and it fades the dark marks i don't even have to pop the pimple it's going to leave a scar so i have to have something to kind of like treat it and this has been my you know go-to ever since the second product that I absolutely cannot live without is my vitamin C serum. If I don't have this a part of my routine, my skin will remind me that I haven't been using vitamin C. It's just a treat. Honestly, once I started adding this to my routine, again, I saw major differences with the tone of my skin. Like, it definitely brightened my skin. So this, with this, is like match made in heaven. Definitely my go-to products. And I don't know if I ordered it because I kind of ordered like the Glow Collection because I wanted to try some products in that Glow Collection. But I don't know if it was a part of the Glow Collection. And, and I just ordered this separately because they sent me two. So I'm pretty excited. I don't have to buy this for a while um, because again, I use it so much morning and at night. So two products that I can't live without. The second set of products are products that I restocked on because I just simply love them. They treated me well, they haven't treated me badly, so I was like, you know what, why not get it again? First, the foaming cleanser. I love my Mini Mo's foaming cleanser. This is the first foaming cleanser that I've used that has not dried out my skin. It's nothing worse in skincare than having your skin feel like like real like you know tight like you it's cracking this is so moisturizing and i mean for it to be a foaming cleanser you know foaming cleanser is really good for deep cleansing and what more do you want uh out of a foaming cleanser uh the second thing that i restocked on was their toner their balanced toner um again i don't tone my face as much as i should i know i'm trying to get better at it i'm trying to you know make it do what it do i actually really really enjoyed this toner um, last time i got it again it doesn't leave my skin like if it's not if it doesn't make me feel like my skin is about to crack off i'm here for it and that's definitely in this toner so i'm excited to reuse this i'm really big on moisture i really love my skin to feel hydrated i'm also a sweaty monster so 
it's like you know I need something that's not gonna make me it's gonna make me look hydrated but not like I'm about to I've been cooking chicken all day you know what I'm saying like I, I need something that's gonna make me feel healthy and not um, disgusting sometimes if I wear really heavy creams it can make me feel really greasy these both are very very lightweight this one is specifically for brightening I like this and again with the combination of the turmeric scrub uh, the vitamin C I definitely felt like it was doing what needed to be done and this is for hydration moisture again it's not heavy it's light and it just makes me feel I feel healthy when I use this I, I feel refreshed when I use this and I use it pretty much every day so love this moisturizer side note if y'all haven't learned anything from my last skincare haul I'm gonna pop that up here I love 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 aesthetic of a product i'm very into packaging i know it sounds really stupid but if the product looks whack i don't want it and i know that sounds bad you gotta it's supposed to be okay does the product work first i get that and i understand that but the way i see it the way my world works i want a product that works and i also want a product that's pretty point blank period like i just i need it to look aesthetically pleasing because if it doesn't I can't do it now granted I'm not big into colors but the minimalism of this packaging I was with this pro uh, this program I was with this product I was using this product when they had the first set of packaging and that wasn't bad but they have stepped up their game tremendously like I just feel like it looks expensive and it's not you know it's very affordable and I don't know it's just I think they're they designed this packaging really really well this is a real side note tidbit but whatever this isn't skincare I apologize this is hair care this is their I'm gonna butcher this a your verdict oh a your I'm not gonna repeat it hair growth serum I don't know if my hair grows off of this but you guys I'm obsessed with the way this smells and I hope let me make sure I got the right scent because if I got unscented I'm literally gonna probably like have a meltdown Can I? where's my knife yes so sorry i didn't say what the scent was the scent is the buttercream and i know that's probably like girl why do you want cake in your hair this makes me feel like a, a i was going to say a sexy pastry this makes me feel delicious i'm not going to lie like honestly it smells so good i lie to you not a bee kind of flew on my hair because i thought i think he thought i was honey for real like no joke um, i'm not saying that's the reason you should buy it but i'm obsessed with the smell and it does hydrate my scalp it's very thick um, again, not skincare, but love this product from this brand. Y'all, they've been shoving these. They've been shoving these lip scrubs down my throat. I usually buy my stuff in bulk, so this is like my complimentary gift. And I literally have two more in the, uh, my closet. And I like it. I, I don't scrub my lips too much. Probably like maybe once every two weeks. It does what needs to be done. Um, so yeah, I love it, um, but please stop sending me these things. If you want me to have a complimentary gift, send me another one of these, because these... <laughs> Alright, so, still staying in this brand, um, I'm moving on to products that I'm excited to try, or I wanted to try. I've been looking at these products for a while, but I just never, you know, wasn't in the budget, didn't feel like getting it. I already had my routine, so it was like, why do I need it? But I was like, why not? Now, so, first another toner i know i just said that i'm really bad at toning my skin but i'm going to try to get better and i'm hoping that this is going to kind of motivate me to to tone because this is rose soothe rose soothing flare control toner um like i said i had a facial explosion maybe i shouldn't say facial explosion but my 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 skin just was like acting up like it was just angry with me like as if i like it was really inflamed and stuff so i'm hoping that this will help me kind of control those type of random breakouts because i love rose water so that's a part of my everyday routine as well and then green tea is amazing and then the oat protein is pretty interesting i've never heard that in skincare before i should tell you guys the um ingredients but I feel like I'm not a skincare guru. <laughs> I just like to buy stuff that works for me and stuff that shows me results. So, and go to their website later. I'll probably link it in the description below and then you can decide if the ingredients is what tickles your fancy. But yeah, sorry if the, anyone who's watching this, they're more ingredients based. Then I decided to get the Lumen Dark Spot Corrector again. 
my face loves hyperpigmentation like i'm a scar queen okay and so i'm really trying to find that magical serum that basically helps me fade my dark marks quicker i usually could kind of get rid of my hyperpigmentation maybe like a month even though i had this real i better not be blurry i had this real weird like mark from essence festival which was 2022 for me this weird dark mark that stayed literally on my skin for like a year and it just it just I guess it was so deep into my skin I don't know but it took a long time so I'm trying to find a routine that fades dark marks quickly or quicker because at the end of the day it's a process you know skin so it has to renew itself but yeah I'm trying to find that magical serum and maybe it's this one who knows I'm not gonna lie this came a part of the collection and I wasn't really too like oh I need to try this right now I was intrigued by it but I was like, mm, I don't really need that because I'm not a mud girl. This is a mud mask. It's called Miracle and it's a dead sea mud mask. I'm not a mud girl. I'm more of a, a exfoliant. Again, I love turmeric. Um, I want to get more into hydrating mask and um, sheet mask and things like that. But mud has never really, mud and clay. I used to use the Aztec, um, the Aztec mask, which is, it did what it needs to do, but Outside of drying out my face, I didn't really understand, you know, or see the difference or see that it was really, you know, making my skin amazing. So I am interested to see this because I have it now, but I don't know how often I'm going to use this. We shall see. Yeah. Oh, one more thing from my memo. Again, I'm trying to get into sheet mask and this is a turmeric skin brightening sheet mask. Um, I have some sheet masks in the closet from Tony Moly's. Um, which were really 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 good like I'm really I'm enjoying using those um, so When I saw this I was like, you know, why not? Let me just try it. Um, it's only one sheet in here, which I think is really really wet um, But you know again, what can you do? What can you say? I'm excited to try this again turmeric is my all-time favorite You know ingredient in skincare. So I'm hoping that you know gives me some exciting results so we're moving out of my mini mo that was everything I got from my mini mo again I love that company uh, the next company that I've really been enjoying um, is you can actually get it in Target um, also side note my mini mo is black owned I forgot to add that in there um, and again uh, y'all yeah, know my philosophy about buying from black owned businesses especially when it comes to skincare hair care makeup why not buy products from people who look like you um, because they know you know what our skin needs and they know what ingredients works for our pigmentation so but this company is called Bioma um, they're not black owned but I believe they're minor minority owned I'll have to look more into it but one day I ran out of cleanser and I was like I gotta get something from Target real quick so I got their gel cleanser and I fell in love with it this is super lightweight again I don't really like I think I said this in the last video and it might sound dirty to some people, but I really don't like washing my face in the morning. I'm more of a, a micellar water type girl. Um, but if I don't wash my face the night before, I kind of have to wash my face the next day, the next morning. So this is like the perfect, perfect cleanser for a morning wash. It just kind of gives me that boost. It's called um, the Creamy Jelly Cleanser. And it does have a jelly consistency, but uh, basically has uh, licorice root, green tea, and I'm gonna also butcher this, but it's called the Triceramide Complex. Again, some good stuff in here. It makes me feel refreshed and like, ugh, brand new. So I love, love, love this product and I probably will keep buying it because again, it makes my skin feel really clean. Uh, because I love the cleanser so much, I decided to move forward with one of their serums and I got their Hydrating Recovery Oil. Um, I love facial oil. I don't use facial oils every day. I probably use them maybe three times a week. I've been looking at this for a while um, and so I was just like, you know what, why not? Let me just go ahead and try it and see what it does. Again, I don't use it often, oil often, but you know, maybe it's lightweight, maybe it's not as thick as I'm expecting it to be, but we will see. Next brand. So this is also another brand from Target that is black owned. And again, I've been keeping my eye on this product, this line for a while. And I kept telling myself, I wanna buy it, I'm gonna try it out, I'm gonna try it out. Never got around to doing it, but I ended up doing it. And it's called, I wanna say it's the Undefined Beauty. I mean, yeah, Undefined Beauty. I'm quite sure you guys have seen this. Yeah, it's a gel cleanser. So I don't know if I'm gonna replace this, 
with this we'll see how much i like it oh yeah this is the product that i haven't tried so i haven't tried this and i haven't tried this so i'm excited to try this product another product from that brand is their gel cream moisturizer okay i haven't really divvied out of my i've been using this moisturizer literally for years so i don't know if this is going to be a forever thing but i am interested in gel moisturizers i love the look of glass skin and i just i feel like gel moisturizers help you accomplish that look a little bit more um so i don't know about this but i'm excited to try this my last product also from undefined beauty oh i was about to get so sad i thought this was i was about to say no stuff is expensive this is their day serum and as you can see it comes with their little dropper first of all i love this packaging like so cute um but yeah i'm excited to try this um serum it has it's called the brightening pore refining y'all i'm trying to have non-existent pores so anything that brings me closer to that is going to be a a plus in my book so again just try stuff out seeing if it works for me seeing if i like it again because i have so many products i'm not i probably won't use them all at once i probably will like you know do it over a span of a few weeks to see what works and also i have this thing where i like to kind of stay in the product line like if i want to have a serum i like to kind of reinforce it with the moisturizer that came with that brand because usually they complement each other but we will see i might switch it up i don't know yet but outside of that y'all that's my skincare haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel like it always feels like Christmas when I'm using these or doing these like unboxings because it's just like ah 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 like I just I'm so excited to try these products. Um and yeah, if you want the results, let me know. Hit me up. With that being said, thank you for watching. If you're watching, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace. Bye. They're taking a pure electric signal and sculpting it into something of beauty.